Good morning. Good morning. It is a hot, sticky, humid, oh. miserable day <laughs> it, here in central Virginia. <laughs> Today is about getting the truck ready yes. to tow a fifth wheel. What we've got to do today is I'll show you what I ordered, but I ordered a fifth wheel. You got to put that in. Um, we have to install a light plug in the side of the bed over here for trailer lights for going down the road. And also I have a toolbox in this truck that is pretty high profile and it works great for going to the racetrack. However, I'm concerned that it might hit the front of our camper if we get into a flexing situation where the camper's kind of up and the truck is kind of doing this number. Yeah. Um, and the last thing I want to do is damage yeah. this very expensive piece of property. I do. I don't want this to be a total how-to video. That's not on, what this is. <laughs> on a fifth wheel, um, it's more of you know these these are the options that are out there. This is stuff you can do that you could do yourself. Yeah. Um, because I've seen a lot of other videos where um, people have the rails in the bed of their truck, or they have the puck system well we don't have that um long before youtube i put a b and w gooseneck hitch in this truck the turnover ball system and b and w makes a what they call their companion hitch and all you do is you remove the turnover ball and you slide the fifth wheel in there and you lock it in place and job is done so that is already under the truck um I'm definitely glad you guys weren't there for that experience. Um, we bought this truck used, and the person that used it before us definitely hauled some heavy stuff, and the newer Ford beds are not as strong as they used to be. So the bed was wavy, and getting the components in there for that, let's just say it was a cusser of an experience. <laughs> We're gonna deal with the flies and the mosquitoes and the sun and the heat and the sweat and yeah. get this thing together. So yes. let's get started. All right, well, after much sweating, a little cussing, we have accomplished getting the fifth wheel into the bed of the truck um this is a twin jaw fifth wheel so it means that it comes around the side and locks around the kingpin that way there's nothing that comes across the back kind of like most tractor trailers um real nice fifth wheel moves around quite freely um to release the handle you just remove the safety pin here which because it's new, it's going to give me a fit. And that opens up. Back the trailer under there and go lock in. Safety pin in it. We ready to tow. I'm very happy. Mm -hmm. 